When it comes to real estate, how to satisfy a woman, and understanding whiskey, it's all about location. Now, while we don't have time in this video to help you with the woman thing, we can help you understand your whiskeys a little bit better. All scotch and bourbon is whiskey, but not all whiskey can say they're scotch or bourbon. Now stay with me. Only whiskey made in Scotland can be called scotch. It also has to be made with malted barley. Scotch whiskey is distilled twice and tends to have a smoky, peaty profile. And the older it is, the darker the brown. We like Glenmorangie because they have a range of scotches from the affordable everyday scotch to that special occasion sip. Now, if that isn't your thing, then maybe you'd like bourbon. Bourbon comes from Bourbon County in Kentucky. This sweet elixir is typically from malted corn, but you can also find some good ones made from rye. If you haven't been watching our videos, then shame on you. We talk about our favorite bourbons and how to make a great Manhattan in another video. So once this is done, click on the link in the post below me. That being said, we love Bullet Bourbon because not only does it sound rugged to order, it has a wonderful smell of caramel and vanilla and it smells with a hint of honey, cinnamon, and coriander. Now you can continue to argue which one is better, but it comes down to personal preference, atmosphere, and mood. If you like there to be a bit of smoke or peat in your whiskey, then by all means, drink scotch. If that smokiness reminds you of your nights and days gone by in bars where smoking is allowed, lean towards bourbon. It's not rocket science. It goes back to the main theme of this video. No. Not my legs, eyes up here. Remember, location, location, location. Now, your homework, if you're over 21, because we have to say that. If you're over 21, pour yourself a glass of your favorite drink and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter. Cheers.